Greetings, friend. Playing outward once again. Okay, back into it. Hardcore mode. We're in the antique plateau. We're again working through rust and vengeance, kind of tearing through it. We need a we need our third gemstone key. So that's we're in search what we're in search of right now. Right outside the ruined warehouse. So what do we got going? We're corrupted. I think we just slept, so our our fish should be good. Yeah. Corruption's working for us. Okay, we got some decay damage bonus, decay resistance. So, which is good for the plateau. A lot of decay dealing enemies. Our decay damage bonus, that's not happening right now because we don't, you know, we need dark varnish or something. We got frost damage bonus. Go ahead and use a fire rag here. I know I got an immaculate somewhere around here. Hmm. Come on now. Yeah. Come on. Knock him off his feet. Good. Nice. Good. Patience. Come on. Ooh. Come on now. Good. So I've got him weakened there. Defilement. Come on now. Can't end this guy? Lots of varnishes, the precious loot. Okay, defiled. Hunger rate plus 100%. Physical and impact resistance down. Lightning resistance down 50%. Attack speed down. Decay resistance up. Decay damage up 50%. Frost damage up 15 So, I'm going to take a sanctifier potion. That, that brings it down a bit. Brings corruption levels down a bit. Now I'm down to just, you know... Your standard level of corruption, which is, you know, fine. Let's see, I used to think defiled didn't have any positives. I've got decay damage plus 50%. Sounds like I may need to, you know, mess around with that at some point. Maybe with, with a different character. Heavy decay damage bonus. That that needs that was probably the element that will give you the single most damage bonuses then. Fifty percent just from defiled. Not to mention all the other damage bonuses from different gear that you can get. Yeah, it sounds like it could be a fun, really fun build. Might as well just Monarch Incense read that. Okay. Well, there's several immaculates around here. We'll go bolt. Might as well go blessed boon. I guess I could decay boon to possess. We'll keep our mana going. I mean, keep our mana. Save it. Hmm. Nice. Yeah, backed him up against the cart. Good. Patience. Nice. Get over here. Can't run away from me. These potions, illuminating potion, gives you mana regeneration. I think they, uh, I want to say it, it increases your corruption too. Oh wow, lots of corruption resistance there. Stone flesh, might as well use one. 
Grants me some rage. Horror shield recipe. Can sell that, I guess. Why am I collecting things to sell it anymore? It's a mystery. I'm not really sure why. Not really sure why I'm doing that. Do I need an extra 10 silver? Cestus. Stealth potion, might as well take it. Rage potion, I guess. Not gonna take the recipe. I could have taken it to sell it. Do I have a mining pick? Yeah. Thick oil gravel beetle. The purpose of mining at this point? That's another that's another question. It's debatable on whether it's whether or not it's worth it. I guess tourmaline. It's a possibility of a tourmaline extraction. Which will work for incenses. Rich iron vein with no just iron scraps only it's kind of rare palladium small sapphire tourmaline nope couldn't speak it there's a couple more though gravel beetle another this is iron central right here Bursting with energy, full of corruption. Okay. Cloth knuckles. Okay, so. Got way too much iron. Don't need that in the bag. Thick oil. Come on. Why? Might as well grab the potions, yeah? War potions, health regeneration, big time. But also raises corruption, I believe. A lot of these items will raise your corruption, but it doesn't really tell you that in the, in the description alone. You have to experiment with it. Might as well take that. Full of corruption, good for stamina, full of corruption. I guess some of the descriptions do tell you. Alright, let's go ice varnish. I know we got more immaculates. I'm raged up, I guess I'll refresh it. A couple. Couple immaculates here. Nice. Yeah. Good. Come on, come on. Get out of there. Nice. Caught up in the mess. Good. Nice. Yeah. Come on now. Get down. Drop. Thank you for dropping. Problem with the weakened sap, you can't see. You can't see the uh, enemy here. Oh. Come on now. Yeah. Might as well refresh that. Dude, they caught me in the... Uh... <sighs> that was a bit of a mess for a bit there. I guess I'll take... Purity potion. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. Cleanse the defilement. Okay, so let me take one of these horror potions. I've got, what do I have? Def corruption 
Let's go ahead and drink that. Sorry. Where's my... There we go. 37%. That raises 10%. Let's eat a... Uh, Perpkin pie. Eat another one? I don't get it. It's not raising my corruption level. That was 37%. I guess that was 38. Now I'm 38 still. Hmm. Let's drink another one of these. 48. Let's just drink another one. I know I'm... Well, let's go with this. There we go. Corrupted. Now we can go another ice. Might as well refresh the decay. Ugh. Come on now. Lost track of him. Good. Okay. Got this dude. Yeah. Drop him to the floor. Get out of there. Good. Nice. Take his precious loot because it's mighty precious. Mm, nice work. Just feeling the corruption. Ice damage bonus. I've always loved this area down here. Three Hackmanites? That's 150 silver right there. Forbidden knowledge. Might as well just drink this stuff. My bag's already overweighted. I got the marble fists here. It's a good weapon. You could sell it for big time cash, but... I don't know. It's just... Wait in the bag. Honestly, wait in the bag. I don't know, I guess, am I doing Caldera with this character if I get there? I don't want to think that far ahead. Okay. Ah, come on. Get down. Yeah, drop. Thank you. Ah, get a, what are you doing, dude? Think you can get away from me? I don't get it. Yeah. Come on now. Arcane oh, Ellie, good. Elemental particle ether, good, perfect. Use that for enchanting. Eat the jerky just because you know corruption makes you get makes your character hungry. So if I pull this lever, that unlocks that gate. It's kind of... That's back at the beginning. That brings me to the start of the little dungeon here. <sighs> My bag. What can I drop? I should probably drop some life potions, I guess. I... Star mushroom? Nah. Raw meat? No. What else? 15 ingots? Gotta hang on to the ingots. Okay, the bag's not bad. The bag is not bad. It's fine. It'll work. Couldn't remember if I looted him. I know I looted that guy. Medium rube. A couple pieces of jerky. I'm not gonna worry about it. I'm gonna leave the jerky there. I don't really want to grab like pieces of jerky out of like a corpse's pants and stuff. It's kind of weird. All right, so 
This is Titanic Guardian right here. So he's got these loadouts that you can program for him. Select Elemental Ward Matrix for Titanic Guardian MK7. So this is armor. Ghostly Wendigo, Obsidian Scourge. I'm going to go Obsidian Scourge Repair Mix. I think that's Obsidian's Fire weak against Ice. I think I'm going to use Ice damage. Okay, settings are updated. Reconfiguration complete. Okay, let's get to this console. Weapon loadout for Titanic Guardian. The Drilling Sword, Serrated Halberd, 10 ton hammer. I like to go with 10 ton. I feel like it's a little bit more manageable. I don't know, everyone's got their preferences though. I'll go 10 ton. So that's the weapon you choose for him to use. Environmental loadout for the Guardian. Go corruption vents. Like to feel the corruption as I'm dealing ice damage. Still got sleep bonus. How's my stamina? Stamina, who cares? I mean, stamina recovery five, 500 seconds. That's totally perfect. Hmm. Water bonus, I guess I'll refresh that. Go cool. Uh, let's rage up. I'm not going to do prismatic. I haven't really been using prismatic a lot lately. Grilled eel, eat that. How are my nuts? I didn't even really look. Oh, they're fine. Still dealing 36. All right, let's do this. The Guardian. I'm itching to get at it. Come on now. Come on now, Titanic Guardian. Yeah. Okay. Nice. Mana push, sweet kick combo. Get out of there. Good. Good. Sweet kick. Mana push, yeah. That combo's getting him. Staggering him a bit. Him. Ah, yeah. As the complex golem fails and breaks down, various nearby machines shudder to a sudden and final stop. No, don't! Ah, very well. You've bought Sorobor a stay of execution, but this is merely a setback. I can start over using other sectors of the factory to produce the means of my revenge. Looks like my job isn't done then. I'm coming for you, whatever you are. Whatever I am, I am Lord Duvernay, the glorious Forge Master, the last true High Lord of Harmattan. You will respect me and the authority that I wield. After all has been done to me, there is no alternative. I will have my justice. I will see Sorobor Academy burn to the ground. I will restore the proper order of things. My demands remain the same. Surrender all who serve Sorobor Academy by the end of sixty days or reap the consequences. Gemstone key A. Grab that thing. Third gemstone key. Bag over weight. That guy couldn't really handle it. Couldn't handle the dancer. It's fine though. A lot of people can't. Chakram? I guess I'll take it. I don't know. My bag. I guess the bag's fine. I can sell the chakram. Moving through here. Alright, we got a third gemstone key. It's perfect.
Yeah. This guy's trying to get away from me. Dude. Yeah, sit again. Whoa. <laughs> Dude, what are you doing? What are you doing? Got a Nux going with some more ice varnish. Let's go nuts on people. Kazite cleaver. Kazite weapons are cool. I like them. The cleaver. They they all weak. They all inflict like weaken. I think. Things like that. Hmm. Just get him staggered before he can get anything off. Eight mana stones. Um. No, thank you. Might as well use that stone flesh. I guess you eat turnips. I don't know. Honestly, at this point, just grab whatever. Oh my goodness, just random. Okay. Yeah. Get down. Oh. Did he hit me? Yeah. Ooh, dude. Get down. Thank you. Varnishes are so good. I love varnishes. Unlock that gate. That brings us... That's... That's that room where there were two immaculates there. Those guys almost dealt with me. Hmm, okay. Now. Now what to do? We've got, our, we've got to get our fourth gemstone key. Where is this taking me? Ancient Foundry? Interact. Train can't go further. Yes, yeah, Ancient Foundry. Fourth gemstone key, I think, is in... Um, Got to access it through the destroyed test chambers. That's the only key that we're missing. The transfer station. Mana transfer station. So, ruined warehouse. Interact with that. Hmm. Okay, let's move through the foundry. Oh, okay, okay, I see. Yeah, there's another runic train over here. It's gonna give us access to the mana station. My enchanting pillars that I dropped early on. Forgotten research lab. Um, Lost Golem. I think this this might get us access to the destroyed test chambers. That's the hope. Yes, destroyed test chambers. Now from here, mana transfer station. I think we've got train key, both train keys. And I think I've already activated the consoles where you use those train keys. Path ahead must be open in another console. Yeah, okay, so I still have to open up a console. Hmm. I thought I opened these consoles. Ice elementals? Oh, they're dead already. Okay. Enemies haven't respawned yet. Kind of hoping they were alive again because I wanted to deal again. Yeah, it opens that gate up ahead. Perfect. I'll give us access to the transfer station. 
two gay bears? Mm, again, don't really want to rummage through his pockets. I guess the gay berries there have been maybe preserved by the cold temperatures. Kind of like being in a freezer, I guess. There's no heat from the body, you know. That's all gone. Alright. Let's get back in the runic train. Should be able to access it this way. Compromised mana transfer station. There it is. Alright, dude. Forge master. He needs to be dealt with. He needs to be punished. Honestly, punished for his threats. Although, my character doesn't really know a lot about the situation. All I know is he wants to destroy the whole city. And... That doesn't seem like a great thing. Filled with dormant corruption. I, I ate that perkin pie and I just is not it didn't give me any sort of corruption boost I, I don't get it junk pile Astro potion bitter spicy do I even acquire burnt stamina anymore eight it's part of the bag ten eight okay Problem with that is that the varnishes are just too. Ugh, they're so nice to have. Like, can you really drop varnishes? Can you justify just dropping spiritual varnishes on the ground? I don't think I can justify it. Illuminator horrors. And a lightning. Arcane elemental. So. Let's go decay. Let's go bless it. Might as well discipline up and rage up. Let's let's just use the spiritual varnish, I guess. Miss Boon. I don't really think these guys are weak to that, but whatever. Come on. Defiled. Okay. Okay, come on now. Good. Get out of there. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Got the defilement going. Um. Guess I'll take the purity potion. Oh yeah, and then I'll take a horror potion and get my health regeneration going like mad. I think it's health recovery five, right? Uh, yeah, health recovery five. No elemental particles there, bummer. Boozoo's milk. Uh, Cacropia incense, read it. Lucy's milk I'm gonna leave. I guess I can eat it, drink it. Oh, it gives me some corruption resistance though. It's kinda hoping to maintain corruption. Maintain being corrupted. That way I've got the decay resistance. And the frost damage going. Okay, very wine. Might as well take stability potion too, I guess. Let's drink it. And we'll leave the other one. I don't want to just put it in my bag. Oh, I see there's something something down there. I kind of want to get it. It's over here. Runic train. Runic train's over there. What's down here? Is this a corpse or something? Yeah. Went through a lot of effort to get it. It's a bolt varnish. I'm using a philosopher. I can't remember if I have that. Bolt varnish. Let's just use it. 
I don't know if we're going to be encountering anything really soon. I think we'll probably be able to use it. Varnish. My bag wasn't overweight. I can actually move. Come on now. Hmm. Come on now, Bulldog. Enemies, where are the enemies? Hmm, yeah, yeah. Illuminators. Good. Yeah. Hmm. Lie down to rest, please. Just lay to rest. Don't try it. Okay, do not try it. More people want punishment. They want to receive it. They want to be on the receiving end. Ah, missed him. Sweet kick. Even though the guy's floats. Okay. Loot him while someone's trying to attack me. Perfect. Yeah. Leave. Leave now. I thought I did mana push. I is like I don't know, it feels like I guess I'll just use that. Needle tea recipe. Oh, you know what? I'll eat that wool shroom. Gives me some stealth. It just feels like nothing's going down. Stamina doesn't go down anymore. My mana. I guess mana push doesn't really use that much. Mana transfer elevator key. Crucial to grab. Knight's corpse another varnish. Sanguine flame I guess. Um, my bag's overweight. I guess I'll just go ahead and It's not overweight by much. It's fine. Does this elevator work here? Why can I not jump down there? Come on. I'm running out of patience. Oh, jump down there a bit. Yeah, thank you. Health went down. It's fine. I don't even care. Discipline potion. Oh, this is good. Boy under predator. Angel light. I'll take it. Yeah, it gives me like health recovery four, it gives me some like attack damage bonus. It's pretty good. Um let's go warm boon, let's go. Yeah, I think there's a shell horror or something down here. Immaculate maybe. Shell horror. Ah. Just kind of went nuts on him. I can draw him out. Draw him out. Yeah. Yeah. Just back him up. Come on now. Problem is that lightning elemental is gonna get at me. Good. Come on now. Yeah. Nice purifying quartz. It's big. It's big right there. It's a rare drop. For once in my life, I'm gonna like close down the loot menu without taking anything. Things that I really, want. you know, how badly I wanted to take that ghost eyes, ghost eyes, just out of habit. I already looted that guy, that corpse. Took a lot of self-control to close down that shell horror's uh, loot menu. 
lot of self-control. Hmm. Order and discipline. I'll take it. Uh, eleven great lives. Really? I'm not about to add a twelfth. Not about to add a twelfth. Oh. More greasy ferns. No, it's fine. It's fine. I'm probably never going to learn the great life recipe anyway, so why am I continuing to take greasy ferns? Might as well take that. Another the these guys? Yeah. Sure. Unexpected resilience. Okay, this is the console to activate the elevator. I got the key and the elevator up ahead. It's activated, perfect. I should I should get um I wanna become corrupted here. Corrupted forty nine percent. Forty nine percent. It's gotta be fifty fifty percent you hit corruption, right? I would imagine. So it seems like <clears throat> how am I nuts? They're not dealing as much as they should deal. Yeah, I'm corrupted. Let's see, let's just double check this. Fifty percent. Yeah, fifty percent. So when you hit corrupt, when you uh, hit the corruption level. I should say hit the corrupted level. Primal wind. 50% corruption levels is when you become corrupted. That's the better way to say it. All right. I'm dealing 29 with my attack. Got to get some stamina going. Um Regular endurance potion is fine. Hmm. I think I'm missing something. Corpse. Another one of these, just eat it. Stealth potion recipe. Read that. Hmm. Well, I got another couple big boys up here, so. See that ice damage, huh? Might as well. Rage. Ice varnish. There's the gemstone key, coveted. Come on now. That guy's healing him? Come on, get out of there. Get out of there. Ooh, it's crazy, crazy talk. That's nuts. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. I'm not gonna take that. I wanted to grab the ghost eyes so badly. <sighs> I 
kind of went weak on that. Kind of abandoned the fight. It's alright though. You do what you have to do. I'm not going to be ashamed. Got the fourth gemstone key. We've reached levels of defilement. What's my decay resistance now? Defilement. 40. Just a random predator leap. That became chaotic. It became really chaotic. The shell horror was going nuts. Unwavering determination. Wolf axe, dude. You can get cash for that. Kind of want it. Let's get rid of this corruption here. Don't really want to. I guess that defilement ghost that comes tries to kill you. It's actually pretty easy to deal with him. I guess it's not a big deal. All right, back out to the plateau. Okay. Got a fourth gemstone key. I think it's time to... Where am I? Okay. Southeast area of the region. Near the Wolfgang Mercenary Camp. I'm kinda thinking I should head up to... I got a free Foliota, right? Gotta do it. Got a free Foliota before we head to the Forgotten Research Lab. Gemstone key C, D, A. Two gemstone key A's. What is that from? I feel like that's happened before. Two gemstone key A's. I don't really get it. Shield golem scraps. No need. You can use those shield golem scraps and give them to the blacksmith in Harmatan. He'll craft you some signature armor of the plateau. Antique plate. And yeah, you can enchant the antique plate. Spirit of Harmatan, it gives you like a 25% boost to your decay damage. So I'm telling you, if you're if you've got the defilement going on, 50% increase in damage, you know, decay damage bonus. Then you've got you know the antique plate enchanted a spirit of Harmat, and that gives you another 25%. Plus there's, you know, I think the Couple of, a couple other gear pieces that give you some decay damage bonus. Tenebrous boots, I think. I have to enchant them, though. Anyways. You can get that enchantment. You can get that decay damage bonus sky high. And I think I might want to mess around with that. Maybe not with this character, but... Another character, another time, another place. Come on, just... Just breaking the nuts. Ah! Dude, they're barely... Oh. Yeah, the fists are damaged. Dealing 18.
get the fang nucks on. Kick it old school right here, yeah. That girl. Kicking it old school. There's the big archway. Let's head back to Harmat in here. I gotta unload this bag. Gotta drop some things off. Varnishes. Oh, two beast columns. I'm honestly scared. Should I be scared? Yeah, I kind of should. I don't know. I kind of want to deal. I don't want to be scared. Discipline. Um... I guess I'll just go back. Let's do this too, I guess. It gives me rage. Kinda wanna get one on the, I need to get one on the floor, mana push. Yeah. Oh. Oh, come on, it's so scary, they're double attack, it's deadly, oh, oh man, that, that duo, I'm telling you, that's one of these times in Outward, if you're not ready for those guys, they'll dismantle you so quickly. I know it because it's happened to me. It's happened to me multiple times. That's why I'm now I have a healthy fear of them. They inflict pain early on. And then you're taking more damage than you normally would. I mean, it can turn into a big mess really quickly. And they've got the double attack. they got some hesitation going on. They're a tough one. Sneaky tough. You deal with one, no problem. You deal with one, no problem. Okay. I guess I need some health restoration. Seven jerkies. Okay, okay, let's sell some things. Oh, I took that wolf axe. Yeah. Greetings, friend. Yeah, greetings. Purchase your ingots. And you sell all these. Okay. Need more ingots. Well, I need gold ingots. Need something? Yeah, let's get your ingots. Let's just sell gems. Seventy-two. Okay, let's get more. Can ingots. I help you? Yeah, just give me some ingots. That's all I need. There you go. Perfect. Let's fire that up. What's the? Uh... Okay. Let's get to our stash here in the in the victorious light inn. I want to check the Aegis enchanting scroll. Just see what kind of. Uh... Incense, we gotta prepare for that. Before I get out of here, I wanna enchant the uh, dancer set. Monarch incense. Oops. Might as well put the ingots in. Four tourmalines. 
Oh, it's in the chest, okay. Monarch Incense, do I know Monarch Incense? Hmm. You need to put some varnishes in the chest for sure. Some great lives. Um, yeah, regular lives. Okay, that's pretty good. I'd say it's decent. Four plant tents? So only hang on to two. Why do I have ghost eyes? I guess Gabriel Wine, Ghost that Spiritual Varnish. I don't I don't need many varnishes right now. Why do I have ideas? Yeah, I'll keep the Gabriel Wine for physical resistance up. Physical resistance bonus. So we can craft monarch incense. For the Aegis Enchantment. The Aegis Enchantment gives you, uh, I think it's protection. Fire Elemental Particles. And Dreamer's Root. Fire Elemental Particles, only one. I wonder if I have anything to enchant the porcelain nux. Let's see what we got here. Let's just take the Aegis with us. Wendigo's breath. No. Okay. Palladium wristbands. Fire elemental particles. One. Dreamer's root. Do I have a pedestal and pillars? No. Okay, I can buy it from this guy. Oh, no, do I have gold? Get the ingots. Always. Uh, I should have kept a couple ingots in the bag. It's interesting, when you get a, uh, let's get four. When you purchase a room, like at the Victorious Light Inn, and I think the other inn too in Harmaden, it's almost like the door is, is just remains open for you. It's like a permanent room. I, I don't get that, I, I think it might be a bug. All right, let's go to this arcane, arcanist mage over here, see if he can Sell us an enchantment pedestal, enchanting pillars. Is there something you need? Let's just get four. Not enough silver, yeah. There we go. The war memento. Hmm. All these are sealed. You can't you can't see what items there they can be used upon. All right, let's craft that monarch incense. See if we can get this dancer's gear enchanted. The Aegis enchantment. Yeah. I guess I can only get one piece enchanted. Because I only have... Okay, well... Monarch Incense, there we go. Okay, we got four incenses. Let's pay to get our Nux repaired. Gotta do that, gotta get the gear. Equipment repaired. Want to buy something? All right. All right. Farewell. Okay, our, our equipment's good now. 
Hmm. What kind of teas do I have? Mineral tea? Yeah. I'm good there. Stamina. A bit of spicy tea. Go to the plateau. I have an enchanting spot. I like to enchant right at the bottom of the steps there. Outward's got so many secret hidden things. I bet there's certain spots like, I don't know, some weird spot in Mana Lake. If you enchant there, all of a sudden your enchantment effect is doubled. I wouldn't be surprised, honestly. Deploy the enchantment pillars. So, the enchantment pedestal. I go due north. Deploy it due north. And then if we look at our scroll, any armor, any helmet, any boots. East close. Okay, pillar placement. East close. East far. West close. West far. Okay, so. East close, east far. Too close. East far. Somewhere in there. West close. West far. Okay. Monarch incense. Monarch Incense. Monarch Incense. Monarch Incense. Alright. Let's enchant the... Black Dancer's Clothes. Yeah. Chanting. Protection 2, resistance 3, impact resistance 4. So if you toggle with the physical protection plus 2. Cool. There it is. We'll just leave that there, I guess. Let's get our enchanted gear back on. Nice. It'd be cool if I had a kind of a shimmering... Something, some indicator that it was enchanted. The, uh, I know the virgin, the virgin set weapons and armor, it all has indicators. Got our porcelain nux back on. Let's head to the Forgotten Research Lab. I think we're ready. What do we got? Water? I should get water? No, fine. We're going to be fine. We got plenty of things. Bags looking decent. We got three sets of fang nucks for backup. Yeah. Forgotten research lab. I think we'll access it through the um, ancient foundry, maybe. The ruined hippodrome. Might as well get these dreamers roots because I know I'd like to get the rest of the dancers gear enchanted. We need dreamers roots for that. I think we left one in the stash, so that's three dreamers roots. We need one more dreamers root. And then we can make eight more monarch incenses. And then we can enchant all pieces of the dancer set but we can do that maybe after before we leave the plateau stamina is going down quite a bit um, 
Bagatelle. Yeah, I don't have any more of that. I guess we're fine. The ruined hippodrome. All right. We're going to stop it here. Next time we'll hit up the ancient foundry. That sublime shell. I thought I... I was hoping to maybe kill those guys next time. I think they're already dead from last encounter. Um, yeah, he's fallen. The illuminator just hasn't fallen yet, I guess. Oh, no, he's fallen. Okay, they're fallen. So... Next time we'll get to it, the Forgotten Research Lab. Try to put an end to the Forge Master's threats. Um, made some progress this episode. Got two gemstone keys this episode. And we also enchanted our dancer gear, so our dancer's clothes. Alright. I'm telling you. I'm getting excited about it. Let's get this done. Will? Bye.